Hi everybody, my name is Ian Lamont. I'm the author of Google Drive and Docs in 30 Minutes, available from in30minutes.com. Today I'm gonna to be showing you a neat trick with the Format Painter in Google Sheets. And uh, just so you know, uh, this is available in both the Windows PC and the Mac OS versions of Google Sheets if you're using a browser. And in most cases, if you're using uh, Google Sheets in a browser, it should be the Google Chrome browser, which is designed by Google and it really works very, very well. Um, so what I'm about to show you works in both Windows and uh, Mac. So this is the situation. I have this uh, spreadsheet here. It has lots of information and you can see I've done some things like I've uh, bolded this particular column and I've also, um, you know, uh, you know, made the text a bit larger and bold. And let's say that you know, I did that because I, I needed to call out that column because I was doing some research on that particular uh, review. And now I just want to make it go back to normal. So what I could do is I could go, I could select the whole column and then I could mess around with the formatting until it matches. But there's a much easier way to do it and that's using the format painter. That's this little thing here. Um, it's the, it looks like a paint, a paint roller in the, in the Google Sheets toolbar. This, by the way, is also the same in Microsoft Office. You will see this in your, uh, you know, Microsoft Word or Microsoft Excel, and it works the same way. So what I want to do is I want to make this go back to the same style as this one up here, uh, whatever style that is. And I don't want to figure out what exactly the formatting is. So I can just basically copy the formatting from here and then apply it to here. So let's do that. So this is the, this is the formatting. Let's just select this word here, Canada. This is the formatting I want. It's Arial 10 point, and I want to apply it to all of these cells here. So what I do is I select the cell that I want to be the source cell for the formatting, click the paint format button in the toolbar. You can see it turns green and this one has some, some, uh, some dashed lines around it. And then I just click down on the cell where I want it to start and I just kind of paste it over. All right, so I just did that. And you can see now it looks exactly the same. Sometimes the changes you're gonna be doing are a little bit more subtle than that. So here's an example up in the header here. You can see this one is vertically centered um, and horizontally centered as well, whereas this one is just kind of um, flush left and it's not, it's, it's, uh, it's aligned to the bottom. So if I want this cell here to look the same as this cell here, I would do the same thing. Even though the fonts are the same, the alignment is not the same. So I'm gonna select this cell, this is a source cell, click Format Painter, and then I'm just gonna single click this cell right here, st uh, status. And you can see it was copied over. And I could do the same thing. I could, I could do it for all the cells in here. Whoops, and you can see I went a little bit too low there. I got some other cells as well. So I would do that over. But you get the basic idea. For more information on Google Sheets, my book, Google Drive and Docs in 30 Minutes, also covers Google Sheets. It's a great introduction to the software program. It's available from in30minutes.com. My name is Ian Lamont. Thank you so much for watching.